Hello and welcome to ASMR with the Oscars Death Face podcast. I'm pleased to present the winner of the Academy of Death Facers Award for Best Sound. While many gravitate the film for the cinematography and images presented on screen, as a producer, I know that you can only truly create a world to escape to with convincing sound mixing, recording, design, and editing. Movies are an audiovisual medium after all. Good sound design encompasses everything from creating iconic and convincing sound effects via Foley <laughs> to the little things such as the sound of a punch or a gunshot or the war of machinery. Sound can help you hear a conversation clearly in the hustle and bustle of the city and it can transport you back in time and to another place. All that prelude out of the way, the nominees for the award for best sound are Greyhound. Hydrophone strong, very strong. Hydrophone strong, very strong, sir. Over-revving screws, over-revving screws, sir. He's trying to slip under us! Now, Mr. Lopez! Roll on fire, medium pattern, roll on fire! Mank. Hello, Tokyo? London, you there? Ah, oh, nerds. What is that? Ah, uh, Pops' radio phones. Never ever be out of touch with your empire. No, no, what's nerds? Nerds is Brooklynese for nuts. Jeepers. News of the world. From the cemetery beyond, she had heard this inexplicable sound. The desperate, unmistakable hammering of life. Soul. One, two, three, four, stay on the beat. Two, three, four. That's in short. Sound of Metal. And the winner for the award for Best Sound goes to... Sound of Metal. Congratulations to the team there. Nicholas Becker, Jamie Baxit, Michelle Contelec, Carlos Cortez, and Philip Glad for their role in helping craft a film that more than any reminds us of the importance of an often forgotten sense, while often reminding us that it's also not everything. 